I brought you all here to discuss some business, rather to tell you how it's gonna be. I don't want you pushing your products in these streets no more. I got my own thing. Makes it possible for people to make their own product. They don't need you no more. And right in the comfort of their own backyards. People are tired of your artificial ingredients you push. They want something real, something pure, something fresh and convenient. I would like for you to consider coming to work for me. Who the f*** are you to be talking to us like that? Hey, Mr. Papa Junk, watch your mouth. I heard you like to say crazy things. Might be true, might be true. We make the best product out there anyway, so I'm not really worried at all, to be honest. Dumbo knows why they lie to the people like that. Your product is garbage. You might as well make a sausage called Garbage School. Put it on top of your pizza. As <laughs> far as I know, you might already do that. I see what's happening here. He's offering us something. Right? Aren't you kind of offering us something? I don't think I understand your question, piece of what? You're offering us something that's, like, irresistible, right? You're offering us something we can't, like, turn down, but there's, like, another way to say that. I feel like you're trying to get me to say something inappropriate, something that might get me in trouble with the Hollywood copyright police, you know what I'm saying? Man, who is this guy to be talking to us like this? Keep your mouth shut, little sis. You're not even ready for the big time. Better stick with the junior mafia. For now. Till you get your numbers. You're too little, I can't even see you. Where you at? Where you at? I'm gonna tell you who I am, but first, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. First, I'm gonna make you a pizza. You can't refuse. Ah, I know you thought I was gonna say the other thing, but I didn't say it. But soon, I'm gonna control every backyard in this country, maybe this world. You wanna know who I am? I tell you who I am. Around these parts, they call me the Yard Father. Well, you didn't think we'd only be doing barbecue here, did you? This channel is all about high quality outdoor cooking in a practical and approachable way. Anyone can become the boss of their backyard with some helpful techniques, tricks, and tips. And man, do I have a tip for you today. Try mixing things up by adding pizza to your repertoire. And no, not boring pizza that you make in your kitchen oven, and definitely not uh, delivery. What's even better than all that is making pizza in an outdoor pizza oven. Which brings me to a tip for you, and that is to buy an uni pizza oven like the one I'm using here. Um, full disclosure, uh, I get a small commission from uni when you buy one using the link that I provided down in the description. But uni isn't paying me for my opinion at all. These are my own thoughts and opinions after some real world use of it. I've had this Uni Pro for several months and wanted to put it through its paces before filming any content. And you know, while you can see that it shows signs of use, it holds up really well and is super reliable. I love it. This pizza oven is dope. I love it. The design and construction are amazing and it's really easy to use. And the wood-fired brick oven flavor that you get from using it is just absolutely amazing. There's no comparison. Um, you can use a propane adapter for this version that I have uh, and others, but I prefer to use charcoal and wood chunks. Um, you can even use pellets, wood pellets, like some of you guys who have well, wood pellet smokers. You can use that as a source of fuel here as well. I highly recommend that you get one and order it now so that you're ready for the warm weather. Depending on the model that you order, it could take a little longer than others because they're selling fast. Speaking of fast, this pizza oven takes about 20 minutes to heat up and it gets up to 950 degrees. And once it's warmed up, it takes 60 seconds, 60 seconds to make a fresh brick oven style pizza. That's it. That 20 minutes is a perfect amount of time to get your dough ready and to put 
prepare the toppings that you're going to use and get them all placed on top and ready to go into the pizza oven. Like today, I'm making a quick pepperoni pizza. I have dough already prepared that I place in a bowl and let it sit out at room temperature for about two hours before I'm going to use it. Start with some bench flour and start rolling out my dough into a 16 inch circle. Today I'm using a spring form pizza pan, but you can also place your dough straight onto the baking stones that are inside and come with the pizza oven. Add a thin layer of your favorite sauce and then layer on cheese and place pepperoni slices on top. Then it's time to go into the uni pizza oven. Slide it in with a pizza peel, but don't go anywhere because it'll be done super quickly, depending on whether you cook directly on the stones or use a pan like the one I'm using today. Cooking directly on the pizza stones takes about 60 seconds to cook, while using a pan can take about 90 seconds to two minutes. Still really quickly, relatively speaking. In either case, you have to rotate the pizza with the peel uh, at the halfway point so that it cooks evenly on both sides. As you can see, I was distracted for a few seconds trying to get some footage and this pizza got a little browner on one side um, you know but like I said it gets really hot and you have to pay attention you can't walk away you have to focus on it and not do anything else let it rest for a few minutes and then cut it into pieces and you are ready to eat and enjoy fidati di me quando ti dico che è delizioso trust me when I tell you this is delicious man is it good seriously folks order one right now you will love it and Order anyone that says multi-fuel in the description. And what that means is that you can use either gas with an adapter or charcoal, wood chunks, or even wood pellets. So I'm partial to the charcoal and wood because of the extra flavor that it imparts. So it's that, I don't know, to me it's like that extra but subtle flavor, like an ever-present secret ingredient uh, that just takes the, the taste and the experience over the top. I have lots more uni content coming soon, but I thought I'd start you off with an appetizer for now. So wait until you can see what's possible with this thing. Or I should say, wait until you can see what's possible with it. You will absolutely love it. Trust me. Order it. Get it now. Ciao.